Tiny homes like this one are filling a big need for a lot of people as they become more and more popular. So let's take a tour. We're living the life of tiny home people. Lindsay Wood and her husband Eric had their tiny home on display at Tiny Fest in Del Mar over the weekend. It's on wheels, so it can be towed when they travel. We're just really excited that it is our home. Our cabinets, our clothing, our bedding, all the things that we're comfortable with. Our spices magnetized to the refrigerator. They have everything they could want, all within 300 square feet, including the loft where they sleep. We have a full deep sink. I love the undermount sink. We also have a water filter, a reverse osmosis. Eric worked in the catering business for 25 years in the Bay Area, so having a chef's kitchen is a must for them. I only have three cooking implements, the toaster, the um, burner stove, and the hot water kettle kind of doubles as a cooking instrument. Lindsay is known as the tiny home lady. She does consultant work for people who want to go tiny. And her motto is, if you reduce the size, you can increase the luxury. When I take a bath, I also can hear music. So I'm like chilling out. It's a steamer. So this right down here, that's why the doors close. And full size appliances. Freezer on the bottom, right? There we go. And then full size fridge because we are foodies. And for that dirty laundry? Put that right in there, close it up, and off we go. And plenty of closet space. I've got all of my storage, my hat area. And if they want to, they can even entertain guests. And now I'm going to pull up the entire table that clicks around. According to Lindsay, most people can plan on spending between seventy dollars and $90,000 to have a tiny home built. Because they have solar panels, they spent 125000 on theirs. Lindsay warns that once you go tiny, you might never go back. What I love about a tiny home is the wonderful ability to have everything that we need. The bathroom, the sleeping area, the living. All you need is multifunctional furniture. In Del Mar, I'm Brian White for CBS 8.